And three or four years ago, it was very in vogue, uh, and maybe some of the VCs in the room were familiar with this, where we literally got to the point where we're going to throw some stuff up there, but then we're just going to optimize and sit back and A-B test constantly, and great emergent things are going to emerge. Uh, we can go all the way to the other side of the coin, which is uh, there are some companies that really don't do A-B testing that are really large consumer companies right now. I would say we're believers in both. Uh, we don't believe uh, data and analytics will drive the topological breakthroughs and the big strategic stuff. It's, that's a long ways off, and a huge part of our product roadmap is, is strategic topological big changes that we're never going to analyze our way to, and that I'd say we have really serious conviction that we know when we have this, it's going to be really big. That said, there's a whole other um, place for the use of data and analytics, which is, OK, how do we make the existing product run a lot better? And that type of growth uh, data analysis can be teams that swarm over the whole product surface, don't necessarily add functionality, but just constantly tweak that. So I think there's room for both.